Good morning, everyone. It's Tammy, and today I'm going to do my walkthrough from Monday the 23rd through October 29th. So um, last week was getting a little better, and every day is getting a little better. And I'm kind of ready for Halloween to be done with all of the decorations and stuff, but that's coming. So this week was fully Halloween and I even tried to use mostly Halloween functionals. So some of them don't exactly match. Like usually I try to, you know, put a, I don't know, a Chick-fil-A with the Chick-fil-A. This time I kind of just did a, a meal prep or a meal something. And actually now that I'm saying that, oops, as I'm moving you guys, sorry, I just realized, I don't know if I put a Chick-fil-A anything on my Chick-fil-A. So I may have to find something else. But anyway, that's coming. So Monday the 23rd, uh, Chris woke up grouchy and that was kind of funny. And I did laundry. It seems like Mondays are a laundry day for me. I did do some filming. Uh, I need to write that down for today. I watched Gilmore Girls. Uh, we went to dinner with a couple of friends. We went to a pizza place. It was really good. And let's see. I did do a verse on the Cricut for Katie's class. Uh, I just had my Cricut write it. I don't know if you guys have a Cricut or if you do that, you know that you can do that. There's like pens that you can put in there. And there's even videos on YouTube that you can find to put like in a regular Sharpie, something like, I think like these, but I actually had some pins that came with my Cricut and I was able to use those to write out a verse. And that was really kind of neat because the font was perfect and nothing was messed up and, and I didn't have to take hours doing it. Um, so it was really kind of cool. Even though I do love hand lettering, I, you know, it was a lot. So it was a great option. Um, let's see, Tuesday, this one's kind of cute. I like how this turned out. It's kind of fun to see them when I turn because they, I don't when you're working on them, they look different than when you're just going through and looking. So it's kind of neat. I started a new book called Midnight at the Christmas Bookshop, and that's pretty good. Hopefully I'll finish that this week. Um, we booked a weekend with my aunt. We're having a girls weekend. Uh, with my aunt next weekend, I think this, well, actually this coming weekend, November 4th. So uh, as long as everything works out, we're, we're planning on doing that. So I went ahead and booked a hotel room. Uh, let's see, we watched A Million Miles Away. Katie came over and we watched that. I know that I had seen it a couple, maybe last week, but we watched it because there's an inspiring teacher in that movie. It's a really good movie. I would highly recommend. And um, we watched that. We had Mitchell's Mex for dinner. I did do a Sonic run where I got a pop. That was so good. I love their pops. And I had Wendy's for lunch. Tuesday was the day that I had to work from the office. And Chris brought home flowers for Katie and me. It was very sweet. And let's see, those flowers are still beautiful. I just had to throw away the flowers that he had sent to the house the week before that. So I don't know, I've been blessed with some flowers lately. I love having fresh flowers too, it's, it's really nice. Wednesday, I made homemade tomato soup. I did not do a Foodie Friday, and I know that I need to, but honestly, the um, if you're interested, go to How to Feed a Loon. It's their tomato basil soup recipe that I use, and it's so good. I did a little bit of change with a little bit of, I added a little more herbs to it this time, and maybe, maybe that's it. That might be all the changes I made, but it's really good. You guys, if you like tomato soup, I think you would really like that. Um, I didn't sleep well that night. I was had some things on my head. I did schedule a bunch of videos. I did some chores, worked on my planner. Uh, Tracy and I are going to do Novembink, like the, oh, I didn't show these, but like our doodles for the month of October, we're going to, we're going to do it in November too. So the 23rd was a grave and then Tuesday was a dagger. Wednesday was a coffin. And you can tell it's October. <laughs> we watched Lie to Me. That's It's an old series, but it's good. So we watched that. Let's see. Thursday was a cauldron. I put the witch in the cauldron. I thought that was kind of fun. I did get a, a haul from Sweet Ava's. They are going out of business. I think I mentioned that in one of my other planning videos. They're doing something else. I'm not exactly sure what, but you might check that out. 
I have one more order coming from them, but the store is closing. So everything is on sale, like a dollar a sheet. And then I had some Ava bucks to use. So I even got less, but check that out. I was able to take the outside car on Thursday. It's probably the last time I'll be able to do that. Um, our convertible, I call it that because when my son was little, he called them outside cars and I think it's cute. So I still say that. And I took Roxy to Chick-fil-A and we had that. And I did my eyebrows and I just drew a little picture of eyebrows. I don't know if you can see that, but I thought it was kind of funny. Instead of using one, I just drew a picture. And you know what? I should put a little... I didn't. I just drew eyebrows and then my eyes and face or mouth, but I should draw a little. And I'll draw some hair. <laughs> there we go. Now it's totally complete for sure. I did menu planning worked on my planner and my desk calendar for 2024. I just ordered another binder so that I can work on my 2024 planning planner. I have some ideas of how I want to do it, but I will do a walkthrough and I'm trying to pick out my word of the year for 2024 also. I haven't gotten there yet. Friday, I worked from home and then I actually took off half the day. I should put this PTO afternoon. And um, I got to help out at Katie's classroom, so that was fun. I was the banker for her dojo store. I don't know if you guys know what dojo dollars are. I did not, and I still don't really get it, but they earn money. It's like monopoly kind of money. They earn like fake money, but they can trade it in for real toys and little trinkety things in a dojo store. And so I kind of ran the store that day. It was fun. Um I'm still listening to my book. We picked up Hazel. I had to make a target run. I went to the Olive Garden with Chris and Hazel. That was fun. I mailed a card for one of my best friends whose birthday is on November 1st. And here's um, the potion for the 27th. And then Saturday, the little thing was syringe. So I put a little ghost holding a needle. Kind of creepy. <laughs> even though it's a smiling ghost I don't know the whole syringe thing this I'll like I said I'm kind of happy for October to be over this year whoo it's been a month I made eggs for Hazel we did kind of chillax a little bit in the morning she woke up early and then she went back to sleep so that was kind of fun but she slept on the couch next to me we decorated some pumpkin cookies we went to the Burlington and I bought a coat and a jacket for Hazel I did some dishes. We ended up going to Chick-fil-A. Yes, and I didn't even put anything. So let me find a little sticker that I can put here. I know I have some food stickers or something. Yeah, I'll just use one of these. I think I'll use this candy corn one. We went to Chick-fil-A and brought that home. We watched The Hammer on TV with Reba McIntyre. It's an older series. I don't know. It's not that old, but I don't know, within the last year, I'd say, maybe a year and a half. And we'd seen it once, but kind of forgotten about it and just wanted something to have on the television. So we watched that and it was cute. Kind of like a lifetime murder mystery, kind of a, you know, kind of like that. It wasn't. Yeah. Yeah. And then, oh, that's today. Sunday, I, um, plants was the thing. I made little skull plants. That was kind of funny. And we visited Alex and we went to a place called Ben's Pretzels, which was really cool. We found a little place on the way and, uh, it's kind of like, uh, those, you know, hot pretzels. We used to call them hot Sam's. There was a hot Sam's in the mall, but these were really good. Kind of like Auntie Annie's. These are even bigger than those, though. It's very, very good. If you guys have a Ben's pretzels near you, I would say go. And I ordered groceries. We did a Starbucks run. I did order some things for through church. We're doing an Operation Shoebox. It's not, it's not new to us, but um, I know a lot of churches do it and a lot of other places do it. And I had totally forgotten about it. And it's due next Sunday, so I went on Amazon and ordered a few things for that. So that's what that is. And that is about all for this week, which is kind of nice. It was enough. Uh, and, yeah, so today is a whole new day and a whole new week. And I have a couple of days of 
fall of Halloween stuff and then I will get back to my fall. So that is that. Thanks so much for watching. I hope that you had a good week and I hope that you have a good one moving forward. Appreciate you. Bye-bye.